Hey there, this is Ilze B. I am a Latvian and I teach Latvian to English speakers. Welcome to my four words a day challenge. Today, this is the day number two. Yesterday, I taught you a phrase, Es esmu savas mājās. Do you still remember it? Es esmu savas mājās. Do you remember what the rhythm was? If you didn't watch that video, I suggest that you start with day one, because today I will be building up on what I taught yesterday. So what I was talking about was the language rhythm. And I also talked about stressed and unstressed syllables. The yesterday's phrase started with an unstressed syllable. And altogether there were seven syllables. But you probably want to know what's the next phrase. Just like yesterday, I will start by teaching you the rhythm of the phrase. Remember, the stressed syllables were represented by the word yes and the unstressed syllables were represented by the word no. So, the rhythm of the today's phrase will be like this. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. I'll give it to you once again. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. I counted six syllables. Yesterday we had seven syllables. Today only six. So, I assume that this phrase will be easier. There is one syllable less. So, once more, the rhythm will be Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. Can you say it without me saying it? Try it. And now let's do it together. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And now the phrase itself. Man ir divas rokas. Did you hear the rhythm? I'll pronounce it again. Man ir divas rokas. Just like yesterday, I am pronouncing the phrase in a normal rhythm, like normal Latvians would speak. When I teach in my courses, I usually talk slower than normally Latvians would speak. But here I am putting you like in a natural Latvian environment. So once more the phrase was Man ir divas rokas. And just like yesterday, I will start by teaching you the last word of the phrase. And that word is ruakas. I'll pronounce it again. Ruakas. This word might cause you some difficulties, I'm guessing, if you are not used to speaking Latin. Because there are two difficult sounds in this one word. And the first sound is the Latvian R, which actually sounds differently because Latvians roll it. So the sound is like this. Rrr, but of course you don't hear it that long because the next sound follows. And the next sound is ua. 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 And the syllable is rua. 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 And the word altogether is ruakas. 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 The first syllable is stressed and the second syllable is not stressed. I'll pronounce it again. Ruakas. And now please pronounce it together with me. Ruakas. And again. Ruakas. And one more time together. Ruakas. And now just you. Great! Let's proceed to the word that stands before the word ruakas. And that word is divas. 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 The first syllable is stressed and the second syllable is not stressed. Divas. I think it's not that difficult as ruakas is, right? So, why don't you pronounce it one more time together with me and then without me? All right, let's do it together. Divas. And now you? Wonderful. But now let's pronounce the two words that we just studied together. And that word combination is 
Divas rokas. I'll pronounce it again. Divas rokas. One more time. Divas rokas. And now just you. And now me one more time and then you. Just by yourself, alright? It's my turn. Divas rokas. Now you. Fantastic! Two more words in your account. Now let's proceed to the word that stands before the word divas. And that is a single syllable word, ir. There is the R sound again, the Latvian R sound, which is actually not R, it is R. Yes, but you don't hear it that way in this short word. You can briefly tell that it's there, but it is there. So it sounds like this. Ir. 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 Try it. Ir. 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 And you know what? Now I'm not going to teach you all three words together, but I'm going to jump to the first word. And that first word is man. It's an easy word. It's another single syllable word. Man. 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 And these two words together form two syllable combination. Man ir. Man ir. Man ir. Man ir. In some phrases you will hear the first word stressed, but in some phrases you may actually hear the second syllable stressed. For instance, if you pronounce just this short phrase consisting of these two words, you would normally stress the second word. You would say man ir, man ir, but not in our phrase. In our phrase it sounds like this, man ir divas ruakas. Okay, we've got the phrase now and you can see it on the screen now, how it's spelt. Man ir divas ruakas. Man ir divas ruakas. Man ir divas ruakas. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And I'll pronounce it again and then I hope you will pronounce it without my help. Okay, my turn. Man ir divas ruakas. Can you do this? Try it. And now let's do it together. How many times? Let's do it three times. All right, let's start. Man ir divas ruakas. Now let's do it faster. Man ir divas ruakas. And one more time. Man ir divas ruakas. And now you, of course, want to know what it means. Ruakas means arms. But Latvians also often use this word when they actually mean hands. In this case, I am using it to mean arms. Man ir divas ruakas. Ruakas means arms. And what do you think the word divas is? Maybe you have learned counting in Latvian. I guess you might have. So divas means two. Divas ruakas means two hands or two arms. And you probably already guessed what the whole phrase means. The phrase means I have two arms. Man ir divas ruakas means I have two arms. Do you remember from yesterday which word means I? Because we had a phrase that means I am at my home. I'll help you. That word was S. But today we don't have that word in this phrase. However, in English we have the word I because the phrase means I have two arms. Well, this is the thing. In Latvian it is not possible to have the phrase I have with exact same meaning by putting together 
those words. You need to know other words that need to be put together so that the phrase means I have. And those words are man ir. Man ir means I have. So I'll pronounce the phrase again. Man ir divas rokas. Man ir divas rokas means I have two arms. And it flows nicely rhythmically. Man ir divas rokas. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. So now we know two sentences and we know eight words. We know the first sentence, es asmu savas mājās. And we know the second sentence, man ir divas rokas. Just like yesterday, I will give you the default forms of the words after this video. And just like yesterday, I will prepare a PDF file that you will be able to download by clicking a link to it in the description of this video. Join me tomorrow. There will be more good stuff. And keep up the good work. Bye till tomorrow. And here are the default forms of those four words. Man, the default form is S. Ir, the default form is Boot. Divas, the default form is Divi. And Ruakas, the default form is Ruaka.